It's a beautiful Saturday afternoon in our nation's capital, Washington, D.C., as we welcome you to Big East Basketball. Dynamic playmaker sees the floor, makes everyone better, and also, Dave, he can score a little bit coming off his career high, 32 points. Boy, I saw a couple of scouts here today. They really like Iguodaro and Kolek moving forward in their athletic well, the basketball career. Iguodaro is hard to duplicate. Move on and remember the good, but also look for the future here with the Hoyas. Almost a turnover for Kolek. They leave him open straight on. Three get it. Playmaker at first, looking to pass first and then shoot second. Double team down low. Long three is in there. Oh, yeah, partially blocked. The Styles trying to get off the three. Trailer on the play, Jones with rhythm, shoots a three, bingo. Some pressure by the Hoyas, Iguodaro. Do it all, he hasn't taken a shot until now. Lays it up and in, and he had a wide open lane and just attacked Supreme Cook. Just good recognition, Cook with backpedaling. Everything's coming from the perimeter. The other thing that's concerning too is Epps is 0 for 2. They double team Cook, Masood coming off a nice game off the bench in his last time. They get Iguodaro at some point. Pick and roll game. Pollock lefty generally goes left. There's the hook shot. It's good. And trying to end a five game losing streak. He change of pace. Finger roll. No. Rebound. Styles. He wanted to get to him. Could not. Deflection. Pollock takes over. Two on one. Layup. Counting. And it's six. Oh, it turns the corner. Free look. As we see the rebound off the miss. Right the other way. He flipped. First transition basket for the Hoyas. And this crowd showing that they like that. Kolek shakes free. Seven turnovers for Georgetown. Seven points. The conversion rate by Marquette. Joplin to tee up a three. And he hits it. Iguodaro. They got numbers again. Oh, finds the open man. Joplin feeling good. A little short. Ooh. Bangs into Mitchell. Kolek left free. Deadly come in. Pretty much the prohibitive favorite. Oh, nice slip. Dunk. Iguodaro finishes it off. Cutting hard enough to get open. Stepping into the jumper. Going to work his Iguodaro to get another opportunity. Way outside. Knocking it. He's a great guy to just skip the ball to and just put pressure on your defense. There's another steal. A nice hang and convert. Marquette has been aggressive. They're guarding without fouling. They're jumping the screens. They're getting in the passing lanes. And here's another. Well, it's been a big responsibility for us because he's at the top of everyone's shot report. He's handling the ball out. Nice interior pass. Take it down. Colette. Good look at that stroke, Benny. That is something else. David Pollock, get him the ball and make things happen. Coming up on the five-minute mark from Bob. Oh, nice patience. What else? What more can we ask for? Here's Cole. Nice look off. Goes Iguodaro for the reverse. Another really one that can break you down off the dribble. And then there's spacing right there. It's not really there because the shooting is not there. Joplin has had a lot. Kolek going almost exclusively left. Epps goes almost exclusively right. Soon. And he's the one too. just joining us. Epps been under the weather. Only practiced once uh, this week. Mitchell layup. And he got it. Nice speed. Marquette's won five consecutive games. Jump up with the left hand. Very impressive. Quick transition. Kyle Kolek uh, going left. And that kid has had a bunch of. Marquette's ability to transition from defense to offense is impressive. Supreme Cook, rebound, put back. Up. Expression on the sideline. He is losing his mind because there's no resistance defensively for his team. From uh, got inside with more adjectives. Yeah. He get down. And loses him. And, oh, my goodness. Right to Stevie Mitchell. Marquette number five. Here's Iguodaro to Kolek. Oh, nice spin. Right hand finish. Beautiful. Nobody in double figures yet for Georgetown. Bumba. Fielder. 
Put it up the left hand and gets a nice bounce. There were some signs of potential. Oh, good no look pass. Egan Darrow, he saw it. Down the lane with the left hand to convert. Understand that. Look, we've got a whole another month and change. We can still steal some of these games. He believes he can still win some more of these games in the conference, but he's got to get his three core guys. He don't run here by Marquette. Styles down the lane. And it completes the play. Steve Lowry in the game. Number 10 for Marquette. Step back, Mitchell. Three got it. I think that Jones making part of the Yeah. That was part of the game plan coming into this one it was bucket up and be physical. Yeah. That was part of the game plan coming into this one it was bucket up and be physical. Man. And he oh. recruited him to Providence and Drew came with him down here to Georgetown. You know what? Good for him. Field of the freshman. Some great setups by Polish. Jones has stepped back three fade away and he got it. Wow. One of the best backcourts in the country. 14 of his 19 points here in the second half. Glad to see him up and at him. Fielder gets the uh, layup, took a knee to the head and a collision in the Villanova game Thursday up in Philly. Quick trigger release and all oh, net. No doubt about it. Marquette. Averages eight threes a game. That'll hurt you. Jones. Nicola. Feeding the hot hand. Why not? You know, he talked about how to deal with that. They, you know, they had some, some injuries. Sean Jones, talented guard out with an ACL and a really good team. How do you play through that? And they certainly have done a good job. I'll tell you what kind of game it is. Oh, he's stealing now. That is the leading scorer in the Big East. There's a steal by Jones. What else is new? We got numbers. Jones going to take it himself and lay it up in his life. But there's a next step in two different paths. Travion Graham still playing professionally. And David Hinton. That's an eye opener. Yeah. I think he's been to every continent mm -hmm. in the world in just this year. Umba with a three. Cooley made the move. Lowry being ridden. Fielder with his second foul. He just had a mismatch there. He knew Fielder was. Oh, well, there's a saying in college basketball that you want to be playing your best game, best, best going into February, and that's certainly the case for this Marquette team. Fielder in from Milwaukee or their East Coast alums, but they are liking what they saw here today. Put offense performance by the Golden Eagles of Marquette.